Hi, my name is Melissa Obradovic and I'm the Senior Product Marketing Manager here at Scepter. Today, I wanted to talk with you about this 14-gallon Duramax wheeled fuel caddy. This fuel caddy will make filling your recreational and professional equipment easier to use than ever. No more lugging back and forth fuel cans. Today, I wanted to give you some helpful tips on making the most of your Duramax experience. But first, let's review some of the finest features of this Duramax fuel caddy. The compact design holds 14 gallons of fuel. It has sturdy wheels making it easy to transport and you can take it to go anywhere. The Duramax has two brass shutoff valves, one at the tank and one at the hose. This allows for easy disconnect with no fuel spillage. The hose is automotive grade rubber and the Caddy comes equipped with a hose hanger for easy storage. Finally, it boasts a patented pump handle that looks just like the ones you see at the gas station. It features a child lock for added safety and has a flow rate of two gallons per minute when used in the siphon mode. Today, we will go over assembling, filling your Duramax at the pump, properly lifting the tank into and off of your vehicle, and finally, how to operate the Duramax in both the gravity and siphon modes. Assembly of the Duramax is easy. The Duramax comes almost fully assembled. Attaching the hose is the first and only step in completing assembly. Lay the Duramax in a horizontal position. Make sure that the shutoff valves on both the hose and the tank are in the off position. Then, secure the hose to the tank by twisting the black ring counterclockwise until the connection is tight. Then, make sure the screw cap is securely tightened and the vent screw is closed. Stand the tank in the upright position Place the hose over the hose hanger for easy storage. Pro tip! Check to make sure the O-ring inside the hose is there. These sometimes will fall out, causing leakage. To fill your Duramax at the pump, ensure that the tank shutoff valve is closed. Also, it is important to note that you should never transport the Duramax with the hose assembly attached to the tank. Remove the tank from your vehicle and place it horizontal on the ground next to the gas pump. Remove the tank cap Insert the pump into the container and pump fuel into the container. But do not overfill. When finished, replace the fuel cap and make sure the vent screw on the cap is closed. Here's another pro tip. The shape of the Duramax is slightly contoured, so to get a full 14 gallon capacity, place a wedge or block under the Duramax prior to filling. Once filled with fuel, the Duramax weighs approximately 112 pounds. That is a lot of fuel, but it's also very heavy. Do not attempt to lift a full Duramax on your own. Two adults are required to lift and move the tank. First, lay the tank horizontal next to the equipment you wish to store it on. One person will grasp the top pull handle and the other person will grab the base of the tank. Lift with your knees and place in the vehicle. You can secure in place with something like a bungee or tie down straps. Pro tip, the Duramax comes pre-molded with indents for strapping your caddy in your vehicle safely. When the tank is at the same level or above the Duramax, you will use siphon mode. But first, ensure that both shutoff valves on the tank and the hose are in the open position. Then make sure the vent screw is open. Insert the nozzle into the tank and squeeze the handle repeatedly. Gas will begin to flow into the tank. When the tank is full, release the pump handle. When you are not using the Duramax, make sure you close the vent screw and turn shutoff valves to the off position. When the Duramax is positioned above the tank to be filled, simply insert the nozzle, depress the child safety lock, and squeeze a couple of times to get the fuel started. The fuel will begin to flow in gravity mode. To stop the flow of gas, release the handle. Pro tip, to fully empty the hose of fuel, 
Lift the hose up when the caddy is laying horizontally and both shutoff valves are open. And there you have it, the 14 gallon Duramax fuel caddy from Scepter.